Welcome back. We're currently trying to find our way out of the forest here. After we basically landed in the middle of it after we fell off the airship. We're probably going to get in a fight soon enough. Yep, here we go. Ugh, more monsters. You ready? <laughs> elemental properties. Okay. Every character's attacks and skills have an elemental property. The element is represented by a colored icon and next to the character or skill. The captain's element is wind. Foes take more damage from elements they're weak to. Uh -huh -huh. Which was represented by the icon next to their health gauge. The timber wolf is weak to the captain's wind element. Uh -huh. Looking good. Yeah, that's what I'm talking Close about. Call. Nope. I'm paying attention to these red things, but it comes from so many that. angles. Watch out! Watch out! Oh, we should be locking on. That would be an idea. Hmm. Seemed like the combo didn't carry on to the next enemy. You missed. Oh, I dodged into it. Yeah, got you. This should do it. We fight as one. Don't hold back. Level up, Bell. You're amazing. <laughs> and there's more where that came from. Now. March. But there might be chests around. I don't want to go forward. I want to check over here. Seems useful. It seems it, but is it? Look, uh, I know, Looks that's why this. I came this way. Nice find. You gotta go down the paths you wouldn't normally go down to find the treasure. Basic RPG stuff. Basic. I can see a path on the other side. Looking. Uh, wasn't expecting that. Hey, at least we found a way through. I hate to keep everyone waiting. You know how protective they get. Then we better file back quick and show them what troopers we are. <laughs> I was worried the rock was going to drop Wait. on our direction. That was risky. Boss fight area. Burn! Is it just me or? Yeah, that was Cat. Catalina, we're over here. Huh? Hey, oh, I just heard there? Rackham. Rackham, we're over here. Uh oh. Burn behind you. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Just like that! This should do it! Look, look at the boulder, ain't it? Just like that! You just completely get away from it if it's doing something that makes it glow red. This should do it! Captain. Welcome to the fight. Somebody call for the cavalry? You're so corny. Let's just take down the monster already. We're saved! I could kiss you guys. <laughs> Glad to see you too, Vern. Get in position, people. Looking we can good. Take it out if we link our attack. Just breaking leg. This will help a lot. <laughs> Looking good. I'll finish it just like that. Don't hold back. Looking good. Get him. On me. Link attack. Here we go. A foe's stun gauge fills as it takes hits. Once its stun gauge is full, a link chance will trigger. Press circle during a link chance to perform a link attack with your party members. 
Got I've got, got them him. on my mark. Hey, kudos. <laughs> yeah, leave it to me. <laughs> link level. Performing certain actions, such as link attacks, raises the party's link level. If all party members perform a link attack at 100% link level, you'll gain temporary buffs. I got a bad feeling about this. Mode bar and boss status. A boss's mode bar fills up as it takes damage. Once full, the boss goes into overdrive and becomes even more dangerous. Conversely, a boss's mode bar depletes as it takes damage while in overdrive. Once the bar is depleted, it enters break. That's your chance to lay on the hurt. What's it doing there? Looks like it's gonna run here. Yeah. Right, let's get in there. Nice! Let's do this! Looking good! Just like that! Oh no! Close call! Cut them down! This one's for you! Did I pass? You guys stable offense? Turn that! Into I'm so close I'm getting that link attack then. Skybound arts. Press L3 and R3. Accept the truth. When your skybound art gauge is full to unleash a devastating attack, your skybound art gauge is underneath your health gauge. Oh, there it is. Now's our chance. On me. Tempest Blade. Ha! Catalina, I'll protect you. Blades of fraud. <laughs> Loud and clear. Look into it. Catch this. Eo. I know. Been saving this one. <laughs> Looking good. Bring it. Full burst. burst. Get in there. Chain burst. When multiple skybound arts are activated in succession, it triggers a powerful final attack called a chain burst. Really? Try chaining everyone's SPs together for a full burst. Oh. I wonder when we'll see that. Just happened. Changing Skybound Arts modes. Press touchpad and, and then square to command your party members to either automatically use their Skybound Arts or hold them for later. Hmm. Understood. On my mark. I from over here. Think it's running out of juice. A little more in the day's hours. Looking good. Just like that. Level up bows. What's this Raphael coin? Keep getting them. You guys rock! Captain! Oh, glad we made it in time. Uh. What the? <laughs> Rosetta! Blaken! Do forgive me for being late, Captain. Hope you save some fun for me. Where were you? Ooh, looks like everyone's no worse for wear. Oh, thanks for the save, Oigen. Lyria, about what happened with Bahamut. Do you have it under control now? Yes, I think I do. I think it's more a question of how do you know she won't lose control again? Because we don't seem to have an answer to why that happened, so... That seems to be something new. So we can't... Be sure that that isn't going to happen again. Uh, why did it flip out on us? I don't really know. Well, hanging out here isn't going to help. How about we head back to the Grand Cipher? I'm with Eo. Better get moving before more monsters get the munchies. In that case, maybe we should follow this trail instead. I have a feeling it leads to a nearby town. Doesn't that sound like the perfect place to learn more about Zega Grande? That's if there is a town there. We're only going on your feeling. Could just be nothing. Hmm. I'm going to go with that option because it just seems a bit... of a sensible option. Like, again, we don't know if there is a town there or not, based on what she said, so... 
But what about the Grand Cipher? She's sitting pretty behind some cliffs past the forest. But that last tussle in the sky dinged her up a bit. Be great if we could grab repairs. Okay, okay. Now I'm, uh, now I'm on board with the idea of like, yeah, let's go see if there's a town. That makes sense based on that. Then it's settled. Into town we go. Oh, wonder if they got any plump, juicy apples. Oh, Vern, you're always thinking about food. I like that. It, it The controller vibrated at that point. That's how powerful her stomach is when it's hungry. It vibrates the controller. <laughs> Look who's talking. Uh, my tummy always picks the worst time to growl. <laughs> you heard Lyria's stomach. Let's go find that town. Oh, wonder what kind of city it'll be. Can't wait to find out. Wait, now it's a city? Know what I'm wondering? How'd you guys fall from that high up without a scratch? It's a miracle. Good question. Maybe the canopy broke our fall. In any case, we got lucky. Hey, any skyfarer who tells you life ain't about luck is a liar in my book. Well, at least they seem to understand it's a bit awesome. odd that they survived that somehow. That's something. Because I was wondering. Yeah, there's definitely a town over there. That does seem to be the place from the demo, doesn't it? Just based on the little bit we can see there. Look, I see building. <laughs> Seems like a pleasant place to unwind. Only one way to find out. Let's go. It loads quite quickly, though. This is on the PS5, by the way. <laughs> it's a pretty. Oh boy, this town is nice. Check out the airships. Probably got a strong trade network going. Kind of reminds me of good old Port Breeze. We should look for a place where Lyria can rest. Me? But I feel fine. You've had a rough afternoon today. You shouldn't push yourself too hard. I know, but we're in a brand new town and I want to explore it with everyone. Well, Captain? Hmm. I like the idea of like, yeah, like, we're going to be very hungry after everything that just happened. We need to get energy. Yeah, good idea. Maybe we could grab a bite. Gee, I didn't know our captain was such a foodie. Controller vibrated again. Time to find some delicious apples. Or whatever's tasty. <laughs> if Lyria's up for a little excursion, then I don't see the harm in it. In the meantime, I'll grab the Grand Cipher. Should be a dock around here somewhere. As for me... I'm hankering to try the local brews they got in these parts. We just got here and you already need a drink? What's with you, geezers? What? I deserve a refreshing cocktail after a long hike. Ugh, you don't deserve anything. <laughs> You're all too much. Anyway, after exploring for a bit, let's meet back at that big building over there. Looks like some kind of church. Not sure though. Come on! I want to take a look around! I can't wait to explore. I love visiting new places for the first time. Ooh. <gasps> Message from the Defense Corps. Let's have a look at that. Alright, field notes, was it? No. Archives. Two of six. Message from the Defense Corps. Attention, Volker residents. 
Recently, we've received a disturbing number of reports of monster sightings in the forest. Unfortunately, the Corps is unable to ramp up patrols at this time. We request that residents refrain from entering the forest if possible. If you absolutely must head into the forest, please consult with us beforehand. We apologize for the inconvenience. Well, fair enough. Come on! I want to take a look around! I can't wait to explore! I love visiting new places for the first time! I have to say, you're a real lifesaver. Well then, see you next time. It's always a pleasure. Ah, come again! Well, what do you know? Sierra! <laughs> what? It's Lyria! And the captain the boat! <laughs> you made it all the way to this item too? Boy, you really do get around. You might just say I'm everywhere. Everywhere the cash flows. <laughs> <laughs> I expected the bird to laugh. Visit the knickknack shack for all your travel tasks. Sierra Carte's knickknack shack. Sierra Carte is a renowned merchant who offers a plethora of goods and services to travelers and residents alike. In fact, let's trade with her right now. All right then. Looks like you have enough Raphael coins to trade for four two two forty two shots. What are they though? I've been seeing us get them, but I'm not sure what they are though. A crystal shard replete with the memories of warriors. These recollections of training coax a minute amount of power out of armaments into the number of shards you want. I uh, one, right? Okay. No way. The blacksmith right there makes some fighting mind weaponry if you need some new gear. Fighty mine. Ah, you must be the one Ciro mentioned. Let me take a peek at your gear. Mm, the blacksmith takes care of all things weapon related. You can also sell your items here. Let's use the fortitude shards you traded for earlier to level up the captain's weapon. Oh, there we go. It's a good way of showing you how it's done. Level up weapon. Select the number of shards you want to use on the weapon. The weapon's level will increase based on how many shards are used. All right. Use all four then. Right. May as well. Confirm. Like wait. Why'd you keep going back? Oh, I see. I, I, in my head, this is what, what I was doing. I was, exp like, when, when I'd done that, so it was doing the pointer, and you got the arrow there, so I was like, okay, confirm. I was thinking it had gone down to enhance already, because I thought I was controlling the pointer, so I kept pressing X to enhance, and then it goes back there. It's like, huh? Like, oh, I have to press down. It's like, I get it. I get it. That's, that's me being an idiot. Navigating towns. Icons displayed at the top of the screen indicate where useful facilities are located. The where icon points to the next story objective. You could save your game at any time from the main menu while in town. I'm glad we know where to look if we need to sharpen our weapons. <laughs> you can say that again. Now, back to goofing off. Goofing off. Well, I wonder what all these things are around the place now. So many choices. That was exactly my thoughts. So let's start with you. Welcome, welcome. I have knickknacks for all your travel needs. Claim add-ons. Oh, we got the demo stuff down here. Yes, we'll be having that. Yes, we'll be having that. Right, so what what did what do we get here? Color pack. Sorry, color pack. It doesn't have the U for some reason. I don't know. I don't know. Starter items pack. 
I have no idea what they are other than the Fortitude Crystal. has got 50 small ones! 50! False Sword of the Apocalypse. Why did I get that, though? And pre-order bonus set. Stamina. And enmity. Alright, then. Serial code? I have no idea what this is about, so I'll leave that for now. Crewmate card? Unlocking characters. Use crewmate cards to unlock new party members to join you on your journey, the more the merrier. Sending out the old crew signal, eh? Who should we pop? This is who we should get. Oh, where do I get this crewmate card from? Because this is, this is the character I want to get. For obvious reasons. Does it even say in here who does the voice? Does not, does it? But yeah, Sarah, my girlfriend, voices Kegliostro, so... That's, that's pretty much the only character I, I know a lot about, because... Sarah voices the character, so I know a lot about the character through her. But I need to get a crewmate card. How do I get a crewmate card? That's the question. Hmm. Hmm. It's weird seeing the word Ouroboros, or Auroboros, depending on what series we're playing at the time. But still, it's weird seeing that here. Don't forget to equip sigils! Hmm? Now that you've obtained a sigil, you have to equip it in order to take advantage of its effects. Seen a lot of action today, so let's take the exploring nice and steady. Alright then. So... Wasn't there... Yeah, there was one over here. We'll, we'll go with you for... Oh, hold on. Blacksmith's got something going on. Upgrading sigils, uh -huh. Sigils can now be upgraded at the blacksmith. The higher the sigil's level, the stronger its trait effect becomes. Sigil rarity determines its level cap. Skyfarers, huh? Which one? Show me. Okay, so one increased attack power, surely. Okay. Hmm. Not enough resources. Yeah, I don't have enough resources for any of these, do I? Like, no. Like you can lock it though. Like no 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 no. Okay, cool. Once your weapons tempered. I mean, like that that Come sword. Back sometime. It's like ne never mind equipping the sig sigils. Yeah, don't forget to equip sigils and weapons. They're vital for su survival. Yes. Like let's let's not forget here that uh, it, we, we know what this like. Uh, kind of want to equip that yeah. Sigils grant additional effects when equipped. Be sure to check out the stats of any new sigils you come across. Well, again, it's, I, I want the attack power one, don't I? Really? Anything? No. Okay. I'm gonna go with health on you. I have no idea on any of these at this point. We'll just throw them out and then as we learn what we're doing, we'll change it up. It's pretty much all we had, so. Very well. I'm I'm still curious as to like this here. It's like where 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 do we get the crewmate cards? Where do we get them from? And what's an MSP bonus? Hmm. Because I do want to get Cagliostro for obvious reasons. Don't be a stranger. I won't be. Excuse me. All right. So what you got, mate? Side quests. Townspeople marked with an icon are in need of help. A good deed never goes unrewarded. Okay, well, you don't give me, like, a, a crewmate card, so... I think I'll leave you be for now. <laughs> I can't wait to see more of the town. Like, yeah, I, I think that's a case of those types of side quests. I'll do those in between the parts that, that they seem to just be. Go take things out. A silver key? Ooh. Huh, and you got requirements as well. Interest. Right, let's go speak to people then. So then? Rackham headed straight for the docks, huh? Sweet. He takes such good care of the Grand Cipher. 
I guess after everything we've put her through, she deserves the TLC. All right. All right. I mean, after what just happened, like, yeah. <laughs> so I'm surprised still that it, it was still flying. Right. Huh. Airship of that size is a first for me, but I reckon I can handle her. Uh, sorry for pushing you guys. <laughs> Shucks, it ain't nothing. I'll leave this spot empty, so go ahead and fly her in. Thanks a million. I'll get right on it. Rackham, hi! Well, look who it is. I managed to find a place that can patch up the Grand Cipher. Just got done haggling with him. Um, I'm sorry the ship got hurt. That was my fault. Whoa, whoa, what are you talking about? You had nothing to do with it. But I... Look, it was a random accident. No one could have known our dragon friend would go all crazy. Hmm. I mean, I kind of agree with the... I, I, I want both, really. Because, it, yeah, it's 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 not her fault, clearly. Like, she didn't intend to do it, so it's not her fault. That That's just... No, no, don't blame yourself. But I, I do wonder, like, what happened? Why, why did Bahamut become unchained, unshackled? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I, I, hmm. Wonder what upset Bahamut. Ugh, beats me. I just hope it's not an omen of bad things to come. <sighs> no point losing sleep over what ifs. Let's just forget about it for now, okay? Okay. Thanks for cheering me up. There's that smile. Besides, we're in a new Skydom. Let's see some more enthusiasm, huh? Anyway, I'd better go move the Grand Cipher before anything happens to her. I, I, I mean, I did that to pause it. I, I should have just stopped the autoplay, but... It's like... <laughs> before anything happens to her. It should be before anything else happens to her. Go have fun. I got the ship covered. Eugen's already, uh, making connections with the locals. Methods aside, he did know all the talk in Auguste. Mercenaries sure are resourceful. Again, these little snippets we're getting. They're, they're so insightful for someone like me who's new to this series. Just, just gives me a little bit of backstory about these characters. But that's assuming these characters have been in it before. I'm assuming they have. Someone let me know on that. Ahoy, Captain. Enjoying yourself? Oh, brother. At least one of us is, that's for sure. Come here. Let you in on a tip I heard. Word is there's a village that runs a mining operation on a nearby island. It's got an altar dedicated to... Get this. A primeval god. Well, that's... Worrying. And when this god stirs up a wind, loads of ore gets exposed, ripe for the plucking. Then, this town takes those mined ores to make the finest jewelry. We'd be rich if we got in on the action somehow. You're catching my drift? Anyway, gonna stay put and sniff around for more info. I'll let you know what I hear. See you later, Captain. One more for the road. <laughs> I think he's had one too many. What a cozy place. It's perfect for Skyfarers. Maybe. Oh. Just maybe. Eo, we've come a long way since we met on Fremo. With how much she knows about magic, I still can't believe she's younger than me. Get right up, folks. Feast your eyes Look at the kitty up there. The lovely kitty. What you looking at? Yeah! <laughs> you dumb lizard! Don't sneak up on me like that! Ugh, for the millionth time, I ain't no lizard! So, what you doing, Eo? <sighs> Checking out the makeup selection. Ooh, that's so grown up! An elegant lady knows the importance of looking her best. 
I see. I still don't know anything about makeup. You're naturally pretty, but a dab here or there could bring out a whole new you. Really? I don't know if that's me at all. How about this? Next time we'll do our faces together. With Rosetta's tutoring, of course. Aren't you curious how Lyria will look, Captain? Hmm. I mean, both pretty much seem the same, don't they? Sounds like a good idea. <laughs> Maybe I can be a sophisticated lady, too. Gee, what a selection. I don't know what most of this stuff is for. Can we... Let's go. Oh, silver key. Which this guy gives us in a quest. There we go. But in order to do that, we need a golem finger. Let's put that on our wish list. There we go. I like the wish list thing. I really do like that. Because then if it gets spotted somewhere, it should highlight it. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Catalina, training again. Guess old military habits die hard, huh? If she hadn't betrayed the Earth Day Empire to save Lyria, who knows where we'd be now? You just want Jewel of the Fates here, don't you? Da -da, da -da -da, and such, you know. I might get in some training. I once spent hours practicing my strikes. Oh, no wonder you're a master swordswoman. <laughs> Not yet, I'm afraid. Maybe I'm halfway there at best. You're no slouch either, buddy. But I wonder who's better, you or Catalina. Ooh, ooh, I like the top one. I don't mean to brag, but... <laughs> It's hard to say at a glance, though it might be fun to cross swords sometime. You mean like a sparring match? I wouldn't know who to root for. Then why not both? What? Oh, you're right. There's no rule that says I can only pick one side. No, but, but how would that work? Uh, Captain, before we proceed any further, I have just one thing. Make sure to check our mastery points from time to time. Battles may begin to feel tense if we don't sharpen our skills. Uh oh. Masteries. Characters gain mastery points MSP. Ah. Upon leveling up, mastery points are spent to raise stats, learn skills, and more. Now would be a perfect time to see that in action. Let's have the captain acquire a new skill. Let's. Masteries. Every character can become a powerhouse. Let's start with the captain. All right. Each mastery node is unlocked with mastery points. Select the armor break node. All right then. I like it gives a little video to at least show you it. Yeah, I think I get it. So 510 points at this point. Did I get did I get loads from the DLCs and the demos and all that type of stuff? I'll have to check back and see if I did. Nice! So, enables the use of launch? Press square right after jumping to launch foes into the air, leaving them open to aerial attacks. Nifty! Nifty! Nifty gifty. I'm going to leave it for now because I don't want to waste all these points. If, if I'm going to potentially switch over to Cagliostro at some point and play around with her, then I want to try and save the points and see what I can do. That's the plan, anyway. I'll practice day and night. I mustn't fall behind our captain, after all. Don't know if that's wise, saving the points, but we shall see, we shall see. Hello. There's other quests around. I want to see if there's any quest that gives me one of these crewman cars. We Pinsa. Bet you over there. Yes. Huh? So then? 
But... Where's the quest here? Where are we? This is a nice little area. I'm gonna find this quest. That one. No. Not giving me what I want, which is one of those cards. I want to get Cagliostro! Kitty! Hello. Meow. Meow. Yes, yes. Meow. Right. Oh. What's Rosetta doing? Probably better not to ask. Every rose has its thorns, and every primal beast has her secrets. Oh, we need another silver key for these ones. I, I see. So that's a silver key type chest, I imagine. Hi, Rosetta. Nice of you to drop by, Lyria. Come to see my part of town? Actually, I wanted to ask you how I could help the crew. Is that so? Well, I'd say there's no need to stress out about it. But I want to be useful and do my share. Oh dear. <laughs> I think you might be overthinking this. Still, isn't there something I can do? Let's see. Guidebooks are pretty youthful. Ever thought about writing one? Write my own guidebook? Just jot down the fun things you've seen and done. Whatever you want to share with us. Better than complaining all the time. That's like the opposite of being helpful. You're right. Okay, I'll write the best guidebook ever. I can't wait to read it. Such a refreshing breeze. If you're done looking around, we can start heading to the meetup spot a little early. Well, what we'll do is use this as a point then to end this part, and in the next part, we'll be arriving at the meetup point. So we shall see you in the next part. Ta-da for now. It is a church. <laughs>